morning everyone. Welcome to Exonors 365. Hope you all are good and safe. In this video, we are going to discuss about the important current affairs questions and answers on 18th and 19th September 2022. Do watch the video till the end. We will ask you a question at the end of this video. Please type your answer in comment section. Let's begin. Which country has become the 101st country to ratify International Solar Alliance Agreement? USA The US has ratified the International Solar Alliance Agreement. Let's talk about International Solar Alliance Agreement or ISA. The ISA was conceived as a joint effort by India and France to mobilize efforts against the climate change through the deployment of solar energy solutions. It is an action-oriented, member-driven, collaborative platform for increased deployment of solar energy technologies. What is the basic motive of ISA? Its basic motive is to facilitate energy access, ensure energy security, and drive energy transition in its member countries. Which international organization has granted observer status to International Solar Alliance? The United Nations General Assembly. Note down this point also. Which international organization has granted observer status to the International Solar Alliance? The United Nations General Assembly. All the member states of the United Nations are eligible to join the ISA. Let's talk about US. Where is the capital of USA? Washington DC, who is the president of USA? Joe Biden, what is the currency of USA? United States dollar. So which country has become the 101st country to ratify International Solar Alliance Agreement? USA. Let's move to next question. Which city has been declared as the first ever SEO tourist and cultural capital? Varanasi, Uttar Pradesh. The leaders of the Shanghai Cooperation Organization, SEO, endorsed the holy city of Varanasi as the first ever tourist and cultural capital of the grouping for the year 2022-2023. The SEO Summit 2022 held in which country? Uzbekistan. SEO Summit 2023 will be in India. Note on this point. Uzbekistan handed over the rotating presidency of the grouping to India for the year 2022-2023. Let's talk about SEO. SEO, Shanghai Cooperation Organization, was founded at the summit in Shanghai in 2001 by the presidents of Russia, China, the Kyrgyz Republic, Kazakhstan, Tajikistan, and Uzbekistan. India and Pakistan became its permanent members in 2017. Let's talk about Uttar Pradesh. Where is the capital of Uttar Pradesh? Lucknow. Who is the Chief Minister of Uttar Pradesh? Yogi Adityanath. Who is the Governor of Uttar Pradesh? Anadiban Patel. Who has launched the National Logistics Policy? Narendra Modi. Prime Minister Narendra Modi launched a national logistics policy in New Delhi. What is the need of national logistics policy and why it is important? The need for a national logistics policy was felt since the logistics cost in India is high as compared to the other developed economies. The policy seeks to address the challenges facing transport sector and bring down the logistics cost of business to a single digit. The logistics sector is estimated at 13 to 14 percent of GDP. Henry Silva passed away. He was an actor. Actor Henry Silva, one of the most popular male actors in antagonist roles, passed away. He appeared in hundreds of films including Ocean's Eleven and The Manchurian Candidate. Who has sworn in as the President of Angola? 
Jovalarenko, Angola's Jovalarenko, took the oath of office for a second time as the country's president at an inauguration ceremony held in Luanda, the Angolan capital. Let's talk about Angola. Angola, officially the Republic of Angola, is a country located on the west coast of southern Africa. Where is the capital of Angola? Luanda. What is the currency of Angola? Angolan Kwanzaa. So who has sworn in as the president of Angola? Jova Lorenko. The SEO Summit 2022 has decided to give permanent membership of SEO to which countries? Belarus and Iran. The SEO Summit 2022 decided to give permanent membership of SEO to Belarus and Iran. The SEO Summit 2022 held in which country? Uzbekistan. Let's talk about SEO. SEO, Shanghai Cooperation Organization, was founded at a summit in Shanghai in 2001 by the presidents of Russia, China, the Kyrgyz Republic, Kazakhstan, Tajikistan, and Uzbekistan. Over the years, it has emerged as one of the largest trans-regional international organizations. India and Pakistan became its permanent members in 2017. SEO formed on 15th June 2001, with the Secretary General of SEO, Shang Ming. The SEO Summit 2022 has decided to give permanent membership of SEO to Belarus and Iran. Let's move to next question. Name the climate activist who has named as the Goodwill Ambassador of UNICEF. When is the naked? 24-year-old Ugandan climate activist Vanessa Naked has been appointed as the newest UNICEF Goodwill Ambassador, affirming her collaboration with the organization and recognizing her outstanding global advocacy for climate justice for current and future generations. Let's talk about United Nations Children's Fund or UNICEF. It is an agency of the United Nations responsible for providing humanitarian and developmental aid to children worldwide, where is the headquarters of UNICEF, New York, who is the head of UNICEF, Catherine M. Russell, who is the Secretary General of United Nations, Antonio Guterres. Let's move to next question. Prime Minister Narendra Modi launched Project Cheetah at which national park? Kuno National Park in Madhya Pradesh. Prime Minister Narendra Modi released the cheetah's board from Namibia at their new home, Kuno National Park in Madhya Pradesh. Eight cheetahs from Namibia arrived in India as part of a program to reintroduce the feline seven decades after it was declared extinct in India. Let's check the other options. Which is the first national park in India? Jim Corbett National Park in Uttarakhand. Kasiranga National Park, which is famous for one-horned rhinoceros, is in Assam. Banyargata National Park is in Karnataka. Let's move to next question. Who has become the world's second richest person? Gautam Adani. Adani Group's chairperson and Indian billionaire Gautam Adani became the world's second richest person. He surpassed Amazon's Jeff Bezos. World Patient Safety Day observed on September 17. World Patient Safety Day is observed every year on September 17 to create awareness about different safety measures that should be taken to ensure patient safety. The day was established by the 72nd World Health Assembly in May 2019 following the adoption of Resolution WHA 72.6 on Global Action on Patient Safety. What is the theme of World Patient Safety Day 2022? Medication Safety. Note down this point. World Patient Safety Day observed on September 17. Let's check previous question and answer. 
Pitt State has launched the free breakfast scheme for primary school students. The answer is Tamil Nadu. Tamil Nadu Chief Minister M. K. Stalin launched the free breakfast scheme for the government school students of classes 1 to 5. Let's talk about Tamil Nadu. Where is the capital of Tamil Nadu? Chennai. Who is the Chief Minister of Tamil Nadu? M. K. Stalin. Who is the Governor of Tamil Nadu? R. N. Devi. Let's check question of the day. Which bank has launched the portal named Pension Sati? Please type your answer in comment section. Thanks for watching. Hope you liked the video and you have received some important points about current affairs today. If the video find helpful, please subscribe to our channel. Also, leave your feedback in the comment section. To get daily current affairs, follow Examiner 365. See you tomorrow. Bye.